60. Anyone can prove the sea horizon perfectly straight and the earth perfectly flat using nothing more than a level, tripods, and a wooden plank. At any altitude above sea level, simply fix a 6 to 12 foot long smooth leveled board and rise upon tripods and observe the skyline from eye level behind it. The distant horizon will always appear perfectly level with the upper edge of the board. Furthermore, if you move in a half circle from one end of the board to the other, whilst observing the skyline over the upper edge, you will be able to trace a clear, flat, 10 to 20 miles depending on your altitude. This would be impossible if the Earth were a globe 25,000 miles in circumference. The horizon would align over the center of the board, but then gradually, noticeably decline towards the extremities. Just 10 miles on each side would necessitate an easily visible curvature of 66.6 .6 feet from each end to the center. 61. If the Earth were actually a big ball 25,000 miles in circumference, the horizon would be noticeably curved even at sea level, and everything on or approaching the horizon would appear to tilt backwards slightly from your perspective. Distant buildings along the horizon would all look like leaning towers of Pisa falling away from the observer. A hot air balloon taking off then drifting steadily away from you on a ball Earth would slowly and constantly appear to lean back more and more the farther away it flew, the bottom of the basket coming gradually into view as the top of the balloon disappears from sight. In reality, however, buildings, balloons, trees, people, anything and everything at right angles to the ground and horizon remain so, regardless the distance or height of the observer.